There's an old saying that goes, a man who plants a tree knowing that he will never be able to sit under its shade has started understanding the meaning of life. I've had cancer and gone through the surgery and um, some recovery. Um, it's been hard. You sit and you t your mind tends to wander. You know, what if, what if? After I was diagnosed with cancer, I was kind of numb. I just thought, what's the next step? What do we do? How do we get past this? It's tough. It was a really rough ride. It still is a rough ride. We're fortunate enough to have um, good support and, and a good cancer team. Organizations like Conquer Cancer are important because they fund research for improving cancer treatment. Conquer Cancer funded the research that changed my life. My name is Chi Viet. I'm a surgeon scientist focused on treating patients with oral head and neck cancers. As I started interacting with these patients with oral cancer, I realized that they had very poor survival. Half of them would not make it to five years. Whenever I see a patient with late stage cancer, who couldn't make it? It's very difficult for me as their surgeon, but at the same time, it tells me that as a scientific community, we need to do better for these patients. Occasionally, I'll introduce my patients to each other because I think that um, their journey in cancer treatment is very lonely. And even if you have family members there to support you, it's very daunting to have to navigate this whole entire new world of cancer treatment without any support. Hey, Frank, how you doing? Hi, Brian. You look good. You look better today than you did last week. For both Frank and Brian, they had jaw cancer. The standard of care treatment is to remove the portion of their jaw with the cancer. I have a doctor in Dr. Viat that is so knowledgeable about what's going on. She's, uh, she's pretty much a superstar. I removed about 60% of my jaw and replaced it with my fibula. When the jaw healed, that could have been it. She could have stepped away. But she is looking at restoring me back to as close as she can before I had cancer. Dr. Viet was a true advocate for both of us through this process. She was very kind and compassionate with us, sitting down, talking with us, and, and guiding us through Frank's entire journey. Patients with oral cancer have a much more difficult treatment pathway because of the reduced funding, reduced public interest, because it's a rare cancer. And as a result, we don't have as many advances in treatment as we see with many other more common cancers. I think the biggest struggle for oncologists and for surgeons in particular is funding, specifically early career surgeons. It is very difficult to get funding. That's why having foundations that are willing to fund surgeons in the early stages of their career, like Conquer Cancer, is so important. Conquer Cancer is unique in the sense that they fund a very diverse portfolio of not only cancers, but also clinicians. The funding from Conquer Cancer allowed me to jumpstart my research projects, which ultimately led into multi-million dollar funding. But that would not have been possible if I started from nothing. I think what we're trying to do with research with enrolling patients into clinical studies and clinical trials is to be able to instill in them a sense of hope, not only for themselves, but also for cancer patients in the future. And even when they know that their enrollment into that study or trial might not directly benefit them, at the end of the day, it is giving future patients a hope for a better chance of cure. Every day is a gift, and I just want to maximize this gift. I don't want to waste the time. It just goes back to helping other people. I mean, cancer's not fun. 
We never thought cancer would come into our house. It means the world to me if I can help one person. I don't think that treating cancer is about one miracle after another. It's our small contributions that allows us as a group to take small steps towards improving survival and quality of life in our patients. You can make a difference for every cancer, every patient, everywhere. Learn more at Concord.org.